Hey everyone, Extreme Excel welcomes you again. Uh, in this tutorial, we're gonna create a Excel workbook which will be having different sheets, and each sheet will be having different password to open. So if I share this sheet with a number of people, then uh, only uh, if the person enters right password will be able to open. A particular sheet in that workbook so for reference I have created a default sheet it will be visible to all I won't be setting any password for this and there are three different sheets sheet 1 2 and 3 I'll be setting password for each of these sheets if a person enters password for sheet 1 will be able to see only default sheet and sheet 1 and similar way sheet 2 and sheet 3 so first of all, when this uh, when someone opens this Excel workbook, I want that sheet one, two, and three should be hidden. So for that, I'm opening VB Editor, and on this workbook, I'm putting a private sub procedure that when this workbook opens. At that time, sheet 1, its visible property should be Excel very hidden. So, when this workbook opens, this sheet will be hidden. Similarly, sheet 2 and sheet 3. Alright, now uh, I need to give an option where a person can enter some password. So for that, I'll be creating a user form here. Insert user form. And I'll be simply putting a text box here. To enter that password. Label. Which will say password and a button and I'm going to view and properties window and changing its caption to OK and it's uh, as it is a password so I'm setting its password character to star Now, I want some action over. Alright, let's change the name of this user form to, let's say, password required. Alright. So, when this sheet opens, I want that all these sheets should be hidden and a message box or this user form should pop up. Which ask for password. So use form one dot show. Then we need to add this action again when this workbook closes. This is required because uh, let's say if someone enters a password for sheet one, then that sheet will appear. And let's say if someone saves that sheet. Then sheet 1 will remain um, unlocked. So we want to make sure that once someone unlocks a file and saves it and closes that file, again uh, all the sheets should be hidden so that it can it may prompt for uh, the password again ne uh, next time when someone opens that sheet. So on close, we'll again uh, hide these sheets. Right now, when this workbook opens, all these sheets will be hidden and a user form will appear. So now all these actions will lie on this in, on this form. Someone will uh, enter a password in this text box and hit this button, and all these actions are required on this button now. So let's say 
uh, I define them x or is equal to text box or as string and x is equal to text box one dot value I put a case here case x and uh, now I want to check for three different cases so the syntax for case is basically select case x and if case value is let's say I set password to let's say password 1 if its value is password 1 then sheets sheet 1 dot visible is equal to true right so I'm unlocking this sheet 1 when someone enters password as password one. Similarly, I'm copying it and if someone enters password as password two and if password three for two bracket here for two should sheet two, right? So now it is unlocking sheet 1 for, uh, when password is password 1, sheet 2 when password is password 2, and sheet 3 when it is password 3. Alright. So, and once it is done, then and select and hide that user form. So we are done with our code. Let's try it. I'm saving this file on, let's say, my C drive, PW sheet. Right. Oops. This Saying me to save this as macro enable sheet. Okay, let's save it somewhere else. I'm saving it on my desktop. Saved it. And when I'm closing this sheet and opening it again. Now I can see all the sheet 1, 2 and 3 are hidden. Only I can see sheet, uh, default sheet and it is asking for a password. If I enter something like anything, any text which is not uh, in the 3 texts. So it won't unlock any sheet. But if I enter right password let's say p-a-s-s-w-o-r-d 2 so now it will unlock sheet 2 similar way if i enter password 1 it will unlock password uh, sheet 1 there are ways which uh, we can follow for a master master password by which we can unlock all the sheets so that's all up to uh, the conditions which you write here Thanks very much for watching this session. Keep watching our channel Extreme Excel on YouTube.